According to city manager of Perryton, David Landis, the night the fatal tornado hit the city power was lost, causing outdoor tornado sirens not to go off. Outdoor tornado sirens are not the only way or even the best way to get notified when severe weather is near. KMR Local Force Princess Bryant has more on how we can all be best prepared. We're under a watch at the moment that they went to a warning. Our people, went, when they went to activate, we lost power throughout town. It's not a lack of notification systems. There's a lack of awareness usually by the citizens. At Governor Greg Abbott's news conference in Perryton this past Saturday, Texas Division of Emergency Management Chief Nim Kidd says with weather apps, weather broadcasts, and weather radios, there are many of ways that the community can stay informed. So we need to be working together to make sure that we touch every citizen in these impacted areas. That will happen through electronic communications. Some communities do have local outdoor warning siren systems that are out there, but really you are our biggest megaphone. Please be going to your place of safety at this time, a confirmed tornado on the ground to the west of Perryton. Chief Meteorologist John Harris says the first line of defense for citizens should be first a weather radio, follow behind that a weather app, a news website, and local weather broadcasts. Tornado warnings or the sirens are meant to be your last line of defense. They're meant to be heard outside, not inside of your house. The idea is you're going to have a TV on, you're going to have a radio on, you're going to be inside of a house with a lot of other people, people talking, a lot of noise, and so you're not going to be able to hear that tornado siren going off. And so that is your last line of defense and meant to be heard outside. John, as having not only one line of notification, but also having a weather radio app, Tuning into weather cut-ins and listening for outdoor sirens is the best way to protect yourself and others during severe weather. Live in studio, Princess Bryant, KMR Local 4 News, Maya. Princess, thank you. When you see John live here on the air with severe weather updates, he also is always live on our apps and website. You can get your weather anytime, including during severe weather, live on KMR Local 4 or on our website, myhighplains.com and app.